Hola YouTube and ho ho ho, it is Christmas season, I am Domino, welcome to episode 68 of our Pokemon Ultra Moon Expanded Let's Play. In the last episode we finished up Mount Lanakila, uh, which involved catching a very surprising Mon that we didn't know was there. If you do want to check that out, make sure you click the icon up at the top of the screen. In today's episode we are on um, the Pokemon League Part 1. Now it's either going to be two parts or be four parts. We'll decide depending on how long the battles are if we want to split it into individual videos but if you're excited for us to finally be starting the pokemon league like i i'm so excited to finally be doing it make sure to the like button down below and do subscribe if you're new if you want to be a part of the domination of the pokemon community let's go ahead and start off with a team recap <clears throat> some things have changed since the last episode i did grind up like i said i was going to everybody's level 55 First up, we have Buttons, our level 55 Decidueye, our starter, the Pokemon that's been with us through everything. He has Leaf Blade, Energy Ball, Spirit Shackle, and newly learned Brave Bird. So I decided to teach that to him over Shadow Ball because we have Spirit Shackle and our attack is higher than our special attack, right? That logic? Yeah, that's logical. Uh, but we're holding the Decidium Z just so we can sneak in those one-hit KOs, hopefully. Next up, we have our mascot, that's Frisco, the level 55 Oracorio, with Air Slash, Revelation Dance, Teeter Dance, and Hurricane. Nothing changed here. We're still holding the Sharpeak as well. We have Aru Kenimon, our, the Hax Goddess herself, our level 55 Araquanid, holding the Watery MZ still, uh, with Leech Life, Scald, Poison Jab, and Crunch. I like this one. I know we were unsure about this mon, but has been great for us for a while. Then we have Brock, the image of myself, our level 55 Alolan Golem, with Rock Slide, Thunder Punch, Thunder Bolt, and newly learned Stone Edge, holding the hard, hard stone. So I gave him, um, I gave him Stone Edge, because obviously we don't need Rock Blast. And I was trying to decide if I wanted to teach him Heavy Slam. <clears throat> I guess we'll find out in the league if there's like, some fairy trainer that we struggle against a lot. Um, then we have Oblivion, our what? Our powerhouse, the level 55 Komo -O, with Dragon Claw, Sky Uppercut, Poison Jab, and Claning Scales, holding the leftovers. I know we said we were gonna try and get rid of Sky Uppercut, but there are no good fighting moves that do more than 80 damage. So we're just gonna have to live. And lastly, we have Fruit Punch, level 55. Revile with Ice Punch, Poison Jab, Slash, and Punishment. I taught him Ice Punch at one of the Mantine Surf spots. I happen to have enough battle points, or whatever they're called. BP, I, man I managed to have enough. We're holding the scope lens because I couldn't figure out what else to give him. So before we decide on who we're going to use first, let's go ahead and run up. First, I mean, we're straight up ready. We're straight up ready. Now, like I said, it's either going to be we'll do one per episode, and we'll do four episodes, or we'll do two episodes, and it'll be two each. I haven't done somebody's voice in a while. I haven't done Kukumi's voice in probably like an actual week. Hey there, Domino. Woo, you come a long way. You made it through all the trials and grand trials that make up the Island Challenge. Congratulations. Thanks. I can't help but remember when you first showed your partner back on Route 1, yeah. Just one thing left for you to do, take on the Pokemon League. This is where real fun starts. Mount Lanakila is where we've always finished up the Island Challenge, where we built our Pokemon League right up here, as high into the heavens as we could get, and to show our respect for legendary Pokemon and to honor it. I still remember it like it was yesterday. I went all the way to Indigo Plateau, yeah, right to the Pokemon League headquarters. And I went right at them, cousin. Those gym leaders in Kanto really messed me and my team up. My team and me up. I don't know if that's the right grammar. But anyway, then I saw my team battling for me through it all, pouring their souls and their moves for me. And then the last guy, that dragon user in the cape. Oh, sorry, enough about me. Let's get you in there, yeah. But before you head in, make sure you're good and ready. You won't be able to come back out. Pokeball is shaking wildly. Did you I popped out? My guy? 
Let's go! Yeah, that's cool. That's a cool touch. I'm pretty sure that was absolutely not the way. Looking back at your first partner, the first Pokemon you ever chose in your adventure, you're reminded how far you have come. This is so cool! Oh, that's a nice touch. That's a nice touch. I know there are some people that did not use their starter all the way through that wouldn't get to see that. Alright, thank you. Thank you, Rotom. I want your eyes to stop. Oh my goodness. Rotom, don't do this to me. Now, why did How, why did How not challenge us here? But we're definitely going to be fighting How, right? Like, is it confirmed at this point? I don't know why I'm. I don't know what I'm looking for. We know that there's not any totem stickers. There's only one totem sticker left to get, and I know exactly where it is. We're ready. Freaking ready. Wait. What was that one on the left? Four trainers. Every Pokemon League in every region all over the world features four fantastic trainers called the Elite Four. Here in Alola 2, we've got four trainers all lined up for our Pokemon League. You win your way past every last one of them. You can't leave until you do, or until you give up. Sounds good. I'ma whoop them. I'ma spank them. You see why I can sense those trainers nervous. Stay loose. You'll be fine. I expect you to show me some intense moves and real hard-stopping battles in there. Good luck, Domino. Decidueye. Alright, I say we start at the left. Is this steel? No way. Okay. Um, <clears throat> just a steel to start off with. So let's let Brock do the thing. Because I'm pretty sure... Hold on. Hold on. I don't know my types. If you've wa What? Okay, I was about to say. Um... Let's see here. Yeah, perfect. So this will work out great. This will work out wonderfully. Now, I don't remember at all what voice I gave this guy. But he got a promotion to the Pokemon League? What's his voice? Um. Hey! I could give him, like, a really... Strangely nerdy voice. Ooh, that was cool. You hear that? It sounds like... Actually sounds like you're walking on a steel floor. Kukui asked me to, so I decided to be in the Pokemon League 4. I'm looking forward to battle against you and Sophocles in the Pokemon League. Straight to it? That explains why we didn't battle him before. Wait, wait. Very familiar with this theme. I use this theme often in my, uh... We have a clef key. Why are you being annoying already? Why are you being annoying already? You're level 56? Oh, wait. Did I read something wrong? I did. I was looking at ground. Okay. I still don't have Earthquake. Oh, you're Steel type. That won't. Oh, Steel. What the heck was I just thinking about? Oh, this is dumb. I think we're going to have to rely on Komodo in this. You're setting up? Really? You're here just to be annoying. <clears throat> oh my goodness, this thing is literally here just to be annoying. 
That's actually kind of wild. That did nothing. Um... I don't have a clue what I can do here. Two layers of spikes. Hey. Well, this is probably going to mean that we just do one per episode. It's going to take... Yeah, this is going to take a while. I was, I was really hoping that that would work out like that. I probably... Hit it with one hurricane, because I don't want it to get, uh... I didn't buy items or nothing. I just rushed straight in here. Oh, crap. That's not good. All right, Frisco, I just need one. I just need one. Okay, you can't miss. Frisco, you can't be missing. I can't believe I didn't get items. I don't have full restores. Just... <sighs> I can't believe it. I, I, I'm probably going to lose at some point just because I don't have full restores. That's three misses in a row. Three misses in a row on a move that I'm pretty sure is like... Okay, I actually hit it this time. And it didn't even kill. Awesome. This is super annoying. Might as well just go for it now. Like, it's so annoying, I don't even feel like doing the Z-Dance. I'm pretty sure that's the first time all series that I've gone to do a Z-Move and haven't done it. Wefki to me is probably one of my least favorite Pokemon. Probably bottom 10. I'd say probably bottom 10. I think that's about fair. See, that did hardly any damage. That was a Z move, did hardly any damage. And now it's going to probably use... Okay. So let's switch here. I can't believe I didn't buy items. That's all we needed. That is all we needed. That's our full restore right there. Thank you, Refresh. Smack this thing up, or don't smack it up at all. Yeah, this will probably wind up being one per episode, because it's going to take forever. Also, I still don't know what I'm supposed to do against Klefki. I, I just hate that Pokemon. Klefki is such a bad Pokemon. Gonna, he's definitely going to send Klefki back out. Metagross. Okay, I can handle Metagross. Okay, I think I can handle a Metagross. But if he winds up flinching me to death... actually has a Metagross. Okay. That's cool. 
Then headbutt. Yep, he's gonna try and flinch me all the way. Well, that's not gonna take a lot to fl flinch me to death, apparently. Good enough. And flinched. Watch. Okay. Doesn't even matter. Oh, okay. All right. We'll get this. We'll get this. It's just gonna take a minute. It's just gonna take a minute or two, and then and then we'll have him down. Hacks got us at work, got the burn. That's wild. Hacks got us coming through per usual, and he has another four store. He has two. I was kind of I I kind of knew that. <clears throat> Another crit. Another thunder wave. You don't get to paralyze or Kenimon. Yeah, you're just you're just nope. Oh, sorry. Avoiding moves, getting paralyzed. And three layers of spikes. Who programmed this? Who programmed this? I need to know. Because that's a little extreme, if you ask me. That's a little extreme, if you ask me. Magnezone. Now we have to jump out on three layers of spikes. That hurt a lot. We're gonna go for this. Do half, please. Okay, thank you. Good job, Kamalo. Don't do half. Okay, or just kill me. Because he'll get killed. Literally, all I can do is hit this thing with the spirit shackle and hope that I can go tw well. Hope that it doesn't kill me with one. Okay, I barely lived. I. Barely lived. I'm gonna need all kinds of ethers. Uh, I'm gonna need all kinds of revives. This is gonna be a struggle of an Elite Four. Lolan de Trio. Alright, come on back in. Take you take these three layers of spike straight to the face. Let's go with the skull. He actually has Fisher. Note to self, Molane's Doug Trio has Fisher. Let's hope I remember this when the time comes. When the time comes, let's hope I can remember. You see how much skull does? You can't flinch me. You can't flinch me, I'm the Hacks Goddess. Like I said. I did a lot.
Might have to sacrifice someone. I think this is going to wind up doing more than half. Or we're just going to hacks goddess our way. Jeez. It did do more than half, but that kills. Okay. Is that all of his Pokemon? Wow. First battle, struggle. That Kukui, he certainly found an interesting chamber for me to face. That was a little too wild for me. For my tastes. Kukui made trainers who he thought were strong enough into- What? Who's strong into elite- Whoa. Kukui made trainers of who he thought were strong into members of the Elite Four, but he didn't choose any challengers. He's waiting for a fresh breeze to blow through Alola. Wait, am I not a challenger? Anyway! <clears throat> since that took so long, it only makes sense that we go ahead and wrap up the episode there. Let me go ahead and we're gonna stand right here, turn around, and let's attempt to heal. I have 17 full restores, so I did at some point. Okay, that's good. That means we might have a chance. Oh, stop. Oh, that would have made me so angry. We may have a chance. Okay. So, we're going to go ahead and wrap up the episode there. Our first Elite Four battle against Molane did not go like I was hoping it would because of a freaking Klefki. A terrible Pokemon. But if you wound up enjoying, make sure you hit the like button down below. And if you want to join the domination of the Pokemon community, make sure you hit the subscribe button as well. We'll see you in the next battle where we're going to run through whatever's up here. You can find out then. Until that episode, have a blessed day.